No, anyway. This part's broke. It's got two pins there. And there's two pins mount inside the piece that, uh, that uh, push this out. This holds the nib. And then when you supposed to retract in there when you pull this back but as you can see this is free floats free floater so we're gonna take a tiny drill hopefully and drill the same size as these holes and drill these out then realign them over the pins that are in it and with the jeweler's tools we'll see if we can solder it back on those pins if that doesn't hold we'll remove these pins out of the um, inside and reinstall new pins but uh, we'll try it the easy way first and then uh, as you saw the back pulls out and then the back rotates and the pencil comes out Okay. I took the pen over to my jeweler and Charlie at CK Jewelers and he put two new pens in there. So now, it uh, pushes it out, puts it in, did a good job, so now we got this, we got this, and we've got this, so there it is. He had to custom make the pins. He didn't have anything small enough to fit in there, so we had to make uh, pins. Now it slides all the way back. See, it doesn't poke out till it gets here. But this is just the holder for the nib. So, if you only pull it back here, it'd still be sticking out. So it goes all the way back here. Then this goes in. And now you have a nice little tiny. Alright, I got this other pen to show how small this thing is. So. I think I need an ink cartridge in it. Yeah. 
Anyway, so you can see the size of the pen. I'm going to extend this and turn out the pencil. It's actually a little bit longer.